Well, good morning, everyone. It is the Saturday of the long weekend, uh, Easter long weekend. Um, got a lot done yesterday. Watched a lot of YouTubes on how to get this thing out. Was all confident and came out to do it straight away and I can't find any of the things that I saw on there. So everything is disconnected and turned off. I'm just going to give it a go. Uh, oh, I also want to apologize for the quality of my films. I've gone back and looked to see what I've already posted and what still needs um, uploading and the quality is shoddy so I'm not sure if it's the, the lack of light in here or I was moving too much, too fast. The fact that I'm just doing it from my phone. It's an LG and it's a great little phone and it looks brilliant when I view it on my phone but when I upload it maybe it's just uh, doesn't like to be viewed in a bigger screen or just the process of when I upload it affects it a little so this is where we're at today is taking out the fridge and the the stove top cooker up there I hope to get more done but I'm just that's my focus is on getting at least that done today I've had a closer look at the fridge and it runs but it's it's, it's quite grotty. I'll try and keep it uh, somewhere and I'll just pop it up on Craigslist or something for free. <clears throat> Parts could be good or just needs a new seal and a good clean. I've cleaned it but it still stinks <laughs> so I'll clean it again with vinegar and uh, baking powder or something. Give it a good clean. Anyway, again I'm rambling to task now is removing of this. Wish me luck. So, thought I would take the roof down because I knew there was a leak around the air conditioner and whatever kind of board is up there, I don't know if you can see it on here, but it's all bowed and some of it was ripping off when I'm pulling this down. This is all wet and gross and I'm ever so happy that I am stripping this entire van. Uh, I really wish I could take the air conditioner out now. Like I, I do have a big tarp so I could could cover it technically and uh, but if it rains too hard it might not hold. I don't know. I just want the damn thing out so I can fix up leaks and poor Bambi is all yucky and sick inside and oh god look at that so gross so so gross I think most of that has just been uh, the horrible rain that we've had and then we had snow and got quite heavy on the air conditioner so I think that just um, might have put enough weight to um, let some moisture in but I guess we'll see I'm hoping that's all it is is around the air conditioner but if not it doesn't matter we can do it Ooh, I have a visitor you should probably not sit on that sweetie anyway <laughs> Back to work. Oh, I'm still having fun, right? <laughs> Excuse my huffing and puffing. But look what I achieved. The big old thing on the top. <clears throat> Excuse me. Whew. Fit in this little hole. So I need to get the measurements. Oh, smells like a a dead fish pond. So I just need to get up there, clean it up. Just popping a piece of wood across and then I've got a tarp 
all the way set up to pull up over the van and I'm thinking that might be good enough to put one of them there fantastic fans or something so I don't really want to seal it up not that I can right now anyway I've got time to debate that and come up with some funds for a fan um, there is this one right next to it but that's not a fan it's it's just a vent so I guess I could leave that in there as well I'm not sure how that would work but more research so gonna get up the ladder again clean off the top and uh, cover her up I did want to get the rest of this icky stuff off but my arms are so sore I'll just show you see it was just peeling off there Sorry, just got stuff everywhere. Oh, okay. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, so sore. So there's the air conditioner. It's a huge giant thing. And with all that water, I don't think it's going to work. Look. No big chunky thing. There's the tarp ready to to pull over. So there we go. Another great day's work almost completed. Ciao.